गाइस हाउ यू ऑल डूइंग दिस इज काइंड ऑफ ए क्यूक वीडियो ऑफ द करंट इवेंट्स दैट आर हैपनिंग इन द वर्ल्ड आई यूजुअली डोंट मेक वीडियोस ऑन करंट अफेयर्स बट दिस इज वेरी क्रिटिकल टू आवर ऑन पाथ ऑफ एवोल्यूशन एक्सेट्रा एक्सेट्रा एंड दिस इज ए वेरी क्रिटिकल पॉइंट इन आवर लाइफ दैट आई जस्ट कूडंट पास इट ऑफ आई रियली हैड टू मेक दिस वीडियो but this is kind of a break i made this video in kind of urgency so it will not be as detailed as my other videos but i will try to get my point clear as much as uh, possible so 2 years back i made this video say goodbye to government politics and politician it was dated 11th august 2020 i put the time stamp because this information did not come from this dimension i was very very sure this is going to happen but i was surprised it took 2 years for this to get started and the first country has fallen but it is not looking good guys as you know this is a truther conspiratorial channel so if you are looking for any positivity you know hopium fake positivity everything will be good we are going to come out as nothing could be further from the truth guys we need to prepare and know where we actually start stand from the dark forces that surrounds us no one has gone away i will just give you one name hillary clinton hillary rod my what happened she is still alive no dark person dark forces working for has not go, not gone away so how do you think we have won nothing could be further from the truth don't interpret chaos from winning you know so just because people are protesting remember they are mainstream people they don't have a clue about conspiracy and who are really in charge of planet earth so it is a very dangerous time for all of us especially what is happening in netherlands guys holland that is the actual reason i am making this video there was lot of protest earlier as well but i <laughs> did not make a video but when i saw the dutch started protesting it is red alarm everywhere so i already made a video nothing will stand out but all the government all politics and politicians will wither away exactly what happened today in sri lanka the president the prime minister literally ran and they killed few politicians as well sri lanka's economy has completely collapsed this was last month on june crisis is sri lanka defaults on debt as it runs out of fuels cash tap sri lanka turns to russia to quench thirst for oil but i want you to read this headline because it has all been played out because they want sri lanka to collapse guys no one came to help sri lanka all drama what you are seeing thinking that sri lankans have taken over the presidential palace and we are finally winning that is the cia trolls who are flooding twitter with finally we have one meme all over the internet that people are taking over i have predicted this will happen on date august 11 2020 two years back you can watch this video i will put the link in the description exactly how it will play out that is what is happened here so you can pat yourself in the back that we already knew this is going to happen but it is going to be far worse than what we have thought guys thousands of protesters in sri lanka storm president's official residence take dipin swimming pool after crowds broke through uh, police barricade during anti government march so the president everyone literally ran away you might be already knowing this news just just came today as you can see the people power as they say has completely stormed the presidential building and the presidents and prime minister everyone has ran away so this is a positive thing i am not saying anything against this but unfortunately we in conspiracy cannot be this you know in this way we have to dig deeper that is what conspiracy and truth is all about so unfortunately this doesn't look good i know in in the mainstream sense this is all i am all for it guys but 
you know in conspiracy we cannot rest until we completely take over the earth because the dark forces are still here so please un- i am not against all this but unfortunately things are not looking good for sri lanka because they already gave clues what they are going to do next do next because they hold at the credit back because they need less than 100 to 200 million dollars to get the petrol guys but the narrative is such that they don't want sri lanka to come up they want sri lanka to collapse because india this news didn't come because when india was helping sri lanka the front headline news was that look sri lanka is been helped by its neighbor india uh, china and the rest of the world has turned away but when this news came few days back on july 6 the entire world was indian newspaper were uh, silent this came in the inside you know inside pages of indian newspaper credit lines exhausted india asked sri lanka to pay for fuel in advance this is the death knell guys they know india sri lanka couldn't play but india is not in india as we know it is all controlled by dark forces right so it is all over it this was the final nail in the coffin uh, for sri lanka because they are were not getting any fuel from anywhere because the biggest thing was imf and china also backed away you know sri lanka in talks with china for 2.5 billion credit support this came on march so you have april may june july so what were they waiting for they deliberately did not wanted china to get help from any quarter guys sri lanka began talk with china on refinancing debt but this guy imf you know imf is as we say in conspiracy never let go of any crisis never let crisis go to waste right but <laughs> magically even imf was silent they are the vultures you know we know imf is a vulture and they pounce on the misery of humanity but i was noticing that imf was unwilling to help sri lanka guys this was the red flag it ha- happened on april 20 imf was playing in the middle they were not willing to give money even when sri lanka was ready to give everything but imf magically was saying no we will not give you money that was a shocker imf says any loan to sri lanka requires debt sustainability they also stretched it guys they were unwilling to give loan to sri lanka imf staff concludes visit this keep on going you know they had no intention it was not a big money we have seen imf jumping on the misery of countries within a day in hours but for months they you know dilly dallied and not willing to help imf says any loan to sri lanka requires debt sustainability this was the joke since when do china started worrying about imf which we know is from the west right so the mainstream narrative is china and brics are we are against imf but china was worried about imf bankrupt sri lanka can't use 1.5 billion credit line from beijing due to china's imf concern you see all sharat guys every freaking country on planet earth is controlled by the dark forces there is no such thing as china sri lanka india everyone falls under the sword of the dark forces china was suddenly not going to give any money bankrupt sri lanka can't tap 1.5 billion credit line from china as the chinese are concerned the international monetary fund may force delays in repayment who cares you know when china was building the port that is the excuse indian media use see china is the reason china is un- is just a puppet you know so the my point is if they want to solve the crisis if the sri lankan gov even now my whole point is are we all allergic are asian countries allergic to a place called venezuela guys do you know venezuela has the highest oil reserve in the entire world double than saudi arabia google it up venezuela has the richest oil deposit in the entire world not middle east guys and it even now it has the cheapest 0.022 dollar it is like 2 sri lankan rupees in in 2 indian rupees 2 just 2 indian rupees you get 1 liter it is the cheapest pay they just have to 
make a deal with venezuela bargain with what we have in sri lanka sri lanka has lot of you know coconut oil lot of export do the old barter thing do the exchange in sri lankan on venezuelan currency but no the government everyone wants to go to the european created control structure right they could have easily avoided this crisis if they have done business with venezuela but no country will be able to deal with venezuela because of us sanctions right but us sanctions has completely failed sri lanka is not able to use anything america was told to not interfere right <laughs> to help our sri lanka but sri lankans in their wisdom the government even i can predict it will not happen but even if the new prime minister from the people's revolution come i guarantee you he will not make deal with venezuela no country will make deal with venezuela because it <laughs> that is how the world is right so we are all been made allergic to the word car venezuela <laughs> it is literally selling for free guys you all have to do if you give us in conspiracy truth movement all we have need is a ship there are thousands of ship who will get gladly take the ship to Sh venezuela and bring back loads of because of the bureaucracy etc you know how complicated they will make all this thing but most of the indians do not know look it up india buys the highest amount of petrol and diesel and lpg from united states guys us is the largest producer of petrol and diesel and lpg not saudi arabia or russia look it up united states is the largest producer of petrol and diesel in the world indians will get a shock indians export import petrol from us not from gulf or russia as they say maximum oil from india to india comes from us look it up us is the number one it should be venezuela right but this is what made me make this video guys the whole end i will never make any video on current affairs and i wanted to make many other videos but this when this happened i had to make because we know all the entire human race is the subject of the holland guys because of the baby fetal cell in vaccines in all of us when we were kids even if you have not taken the covid vaccine but your parents in their ignorance have given you polio and other vaccines when you were a kid right when you were a baby so it was it had the baby fetal cell of from a baby from the netherlands guys and whenever netherlands go down entire human race will go down guys the entire world will collapse i have told you many time i have made two three videos of after one year break i made the videos only on dutch how dutch control the entire world guys there was a canadian protest there were lot of protest news about ukraine i never made a video because that are irrelevant only thing matters is holland guys and i don't think it is going to stop if you just watch the news on holland whatever happens in holland if you see you can rest assured i guarantee you next day it will happen to the town near you nothing on this earth will stop uh, netherlands is the the country we need to be careful dutch police shoot a tractor during night of farm protest as you can see i made the video on nitrogen <laughs> what you know just about that the protest started in it's totally crazy absurd guys eu to deal new blow to dutch farmer by tightening fertilizer rule nitrogen protest continue everything is nitrogen i know how absurd right more than 70% of the atmosphere is nitrogen your entire body mechanism runs on nitrogen guys i already made a video all your amino acids alkaloids <laughs> all your drugs the pharma empire trillion dollar pharma everything protein fat vitamins everything is based on nitrogen right lymphatic system i already went on detail to the chemistry of how nitrogen is the central figure of everything so that is why they related central nitrogen to the central of humanity dutch and i i think this will end very badly guys so please be prepared 
I don't care about there was a Canadian farmer protest right few months back and US every day something happens but I never made a video but this is extreme danger for all of us farmer protest on nitrogen reduction continue July 8th with blockade of Warden this is extreme danger because these people DNA is in all of us when these go down we all will because I forgot to include this Dutch East India company this was the first multinational company the world has ever seen everything that you see around you the concept of job the concept of shares the concept of companies came from Dutch guys you have no idea the whole concept of money monetary system <laughs> trading <laughs> everything as you can see the Dutch East India company was a multinational corporation founded by the government directed consolidation several rival Dutch trading company it is believed to be the largest company to have ever existed in recorded history the company has often labeled in labeled a trading company or sometimes a shipping company however the voc was in fact an early model modern corporate model of vertical integrated global supply chain it happened 400 years back what we know as vertically integrated global supply chain the voc the dutch had already done it guys and a proto conglomerate diversifying into multiple commercial and industrial activities such as international trade shipbuilding production of spices coffee the company was transcontinental employer and a corporate pioneer of outward foreign direct investment in the early modern world i'm talking about 400 years back guys at the dawn of modern capitalism the entire capitalism crap we are dealing with is through dutch guys wherever dutch capital one urban futures were developed economic activities expanded new industries established new jobs created trading companies operated swamps drained mines opened forest exploited canals constructed <laughs> mills turned and ships were built as you can see all this word you hear about early startup companies investors capitalism everything came from the netherlands guys in the early 1600s by widely issuing bonds and shares to the general public voc became the world's first formerly listed public company as you can see <laughs> With its pioneering institutional innovation and powerful roles in global business history, the company is often considered by many to be the forerunner of modern corporations. In many aspects, modern day corporations are all direct descendants of VOC model. I am telling you guys what happening in Dutch. You may not be so much into it, but you will be thinking about Russia and China and Japan and India, you know. Who cares about tiny Netherlands, right? With a population of only 10 million or so. It's a very small country, but everything is coming from Netherlands. I am telling you, if Netherlands goes, watch out. Extreme danger. All the system will collapse. All your trading, all your jobs. The concept of jobs came from the VOC. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> even the british east india company copied it it also served as a direct model of organizational reconstruction of the british east india company in 1657 one of the most influential and extensively researched business enterprise in history as you can see it is by far guys POC world has been subject to a vast amount of literature that include both fiction and notification. You can go through it how Dutch, Dutch has the fingerprints in all aspect of your life from your morning to your evening to your sleeping. Everything is Dutch. The VOC is generally comes the world first truly transnational corporation, <laughs> multinational enterprise to issue shares through stocks and public but you will think that dutch is such a small country i will wait till america goes down no guys america will follow the entire world will follow where the dutch goes that is why the vaccine 
fetal cell is from netherland i already made an hour long video <laughs> you know as you can see the netherland united east india company was the world first multinational joint stock limited liability corporation as well as its first government back trading cartel our own east india company founded in 16 remained a coffee house click until 1657 when two began selling share not in individual but in joint company itself by which time is dutch rival was by far the biggest commercial enterprise the world has known <laughs> even now you can watch this in global business history the lessons of eos is success and failure are critically important with permanent capital but this is happening right now guys if dutch goes down our own capital will vanish <laughs> <laughs> that is the reason i am making you read this you may think that it is united states no even i made a video on this extreme lithography ultraviolet machine the most com complex machine the world has seen is not even possible to the greatest country in the world called united states or japan or china right or south korea samsung <laughs> or apple or tesla now nothing will run if the dutch stop working this is the lithography machine where the chips are created only one company in the world creates and it's from the netherland the most secretive company that you never knew not intel guys intel or amd is a joke intel or amd to exist asml needs to work on this machine first <laughs> that is the this is very very dangerous guys massive farmer protest across europe i will come to the main point why this is danger dutch farmers and fishermen block road to protest new emission rules i think they will want to make this continue you know because what i see many people were asking what will happen to sri lanka i don't see sri lanka in a good way again guys i see this for the world military on the streets guys this is the point of me making the video i made this video 2 years back i said this military on the streets pay attention guys this could soon be reality around you but it will happen happen so softly and subtly your life will get shit here but government will secretly will be in still charge that is why they was when the crisis happened slowly they started to introduce military right in in us etc soldiers come french now whenever protest happen in europe they were slowly introducing the military as you can see can trump deploy military to quell street protest but trump is long gone but they were slowly bringing in the military for you to get accom accustomed to them pennsylvania national guard deployed in philadelphia following monday police shooting Oh, we know everything is scam and a drama, but they want you to get used to seeing these people in uniform all around you guys. Philadelphia, Pennsylvania National Guard. This is going to be soon the reality of Sri Lanka and rest of the world. I can assure you, new world order is this, guys. Papers, please. Right, Nazi Germany, communism. everywhere you go be ready to take out your id card and show and tell them where you are going for how much time but they have qr code did you take vaccination your booster shot everything will be controlled unless and of course as i am i am about i have to make many other because there are so many forces from all over the known universe that are on planet earth right now guys there are alien wars aliens are totally in charge you know so so many things are happening soldiers come french nurses but are, are paying a steep price there are already soldiers sri lanka crisis so this is not looking good guys i know this is a this is a very happy news so i am all for that but we being in conspiracy and thinkers right we need to think it through we need to think what's next because even after protest the new guy who will be the new guy will he do business with venezuela or will he beg for loan from imf or you know india or china <laughs> that is the 
thinking right we will see but before that military will take over sri lanka that is what why i am think i am coming to because this is extremely critical guys this lion you may have seen it everywhere so i was shocked the first country they decided to make it fall is sri lanka right sri lanka has a lie was today morning only i i i was i connected the dot you see sri lanka flag every freaking royalty in europe has a this <laughs> crazy lion you can see all the coat of arms has this crazy lion in this list in lion in european monarchy's coat of arm i recently found out that the most European monarchies have the same kind of lion in their coat of arm as you can see it is a lion with a strange long tongue this 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 you see his tongue same lion let me take you through this netherlands lion united kingdom lion prince of wales spain norway denmark luxembourg sweden there are many 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 guys and of course then people will say what about the chinese every temple i was just in visited a chinese old temple to get more into the ancient history you know dragon if in the front gate itself you see a gigantic lion right you see Chinese dynasty palace guard brass dragon kill chi chung kuan lion statue pair so chinese are the oldest right so they are very much found of this lion face but then people will ask what about india right india is what about india and it's india is central symbolism is lion satyam ev jete right it's in all currency all government building all stamps this lion the face with his mouth open as you can see his mouth is open tongue out he is something related to dragon or is a hybrid i am not sure what the actual you see his tongue is out his mouth is open the same guy you see his mouth is open tongue is out so there is some people who are designing all this so i don't i am very scared guys about what is happening in holland so please be prepared if crisis hit don't think that my point of making this video is please don't stick your ground if you are having family you know don't try to go out and because the violence they love violence you know they can use extreme violence they don't care if 50% of humanity dies so seek a safe ground i would suggest you to run if you are in sri lanka or dutch seek a safe ground because we are in conspiracy we are not ready to you know whatever it is we are still in a research and development phase to take over planet earth or light or if light comes then it will be a completely different story but so far i have not seen the truth or light taking over anytime soon guys to be very honest i see the dark phase dark forces still ruling us for some more time but uh, i see military rule in sri lanka and in holland and rest of the world i don't honestly i would i am i would love to be wrong but the way things are going about netherlands i am not worried about sri lanka it's the holland that it scares the hell out of me please watch out about holland i if holland goes down <laughs> then you will <laughs> I cannot even tell you what will happen to planet Earth. I know it's a small country, but just watch out, guys. If you are a Dutch guy, I would do not fight. They will kill you. Military, military will come in the streets of Holland. If what their plan is, so please don't protest or come into the street. That is childish, right? We are in conspiracy. We are thinkers. we are looking for the bigger picture so please be on the safe side do not think we have won there is lot of ground to cover so yeah guys this is the quick video i wanted to make about the crisis that we are seeing all over the world especially what happened in sri lanka and what is happening in holland i hope things improve but honestly i don't see it 
happening so yeah guys stay safe thanks for watching